For those of you who got a IBM V3700 SAN, I'm going to show you how to set it up. You're going to get a USB stick in the box. You're going to stick that in your computer. And what's going to happen is it's going to come up with a couple of options on it. There's an init tool dot bat, which is going to allow you to configure this tool to set the IP address so you can communicate with your SAN. You run this tool and it comes up like this. It's fairly easy. What you're going to do is push next. After that, it's going to give you a couple of options. Set up a new system, reset the super user password, or set an IP address. We want to set the IP address. Okay, the IP address. This is going to be the address of your local network. So, set it all up. This is my settings. Don't set this to your settings or it's not going to work. So, set it all up. And we're going to use that address later, the 206 address from the web, to get to the device and to be able to configure the volumes and the RAID. Now, you take the stick, and now I'm going to put it in the machine. There's a little port in the back left, and an orange light's going to flash. When it finishes flashing, it's done. You come back over here, you stick it in your computer, and it's going to confirm the settings. At this point, you can take the IP address that you set up before and go to a web browser and insert it. This is going to bring up the logon screen. Uh, the logon is super user, and the password is password with a zero. It's in your manual, you can find it on the web and say login and the system logs you in. You're now capable of setting up your SAN, you've got access to it. Uh, just bearing in mind there are two ports on the back of the SAN and you can configure both of them um, to have an IP address as a redundancy failover. Um, you can go set up your disks and your RAID selections, set up your pools and these pools will be used for tiering and then set up your volumes and assign those to a host using either a SAS, mine's a SAS, or an iSCSI connector. Super easy to use once you enter the console, it's easy peasy. Enjoy, have a good time.